Hello everybody. In today's episode we will see how to grow zucchini, how to harvest it and also throw in a nice zucchini recipe for you. So to start with, here are some interesting facts about zucchini. So the container I recommend for growing zucchini is a 16 inch wide container which is 15 inches tall and you can see the video description for the product that I generally use for all my vegetable container gardening and you'll be surprised that it doesn't really cost much to grow in these 16 inch containers. The zucchini we'll be planting today is the dark green zucchini. Zucchini grows best when it is sowed directly. I do not recommend transplanting zucchinis because they are very fragile plants and you have to be very very careful if you are transplanting zucchinis. I just prefer to sow them in the ground directly. And all you need to do is take the seeds and space them a little apart. You can grow about two zucchinis in a container of this size. And then you can bury them just about the size of the seed itself, not too much. I've experimented with a lot of potting mixes and I finally found one that is a really good value for money. It's available at most home improvement and garden stores and it's called the Kellogg Patio Plus which is a great mix with great ingredients. So after planting the seeds I usually label and add a date to all the plants that I've planted so I know what's growing where. And also make sure you water the plants well. When the plants are in the seed stage or the seedling stage, you need to maintain a constant moisture which is very important for the seeds not to dry out. So in a very short time you will see the seeds have germinated and there are two seeds which made it which is about the right thing for this size container. In the next few days you are going to see a few leaves come out and this is the time you need to consider adding fertilizers. You can go organic and add a fish or seaweed fertilizer or you can use one of those water soluble fertilizers which you just mix in water and add to the zucchini plants. The zucchini plant will start flowering very soon. At this stage you want to start feeding your zucchini plants a balanced fertilizer every three weeks. If you feed too much nitrogen to the zucchini at this stage it's going to produce a lot of leaves but very less zucchini. And also note that the zucchini plant needs a lot of water in this stage. And the zucchini plant has different male and female flowers. So here you can see both the male and female flowers. Now the pollination is usually done by bees. But if you don't see zucchini forming on your plants, you need to pollinate them yourself. Just take a brush and then take some pollen from the male flower and then just sprinkle it on the female flower and it will develop into a fruit. So one of the most common pests on the zucchini plant are aphids. These are black aphids that you can see on the zucchini plant. And today I'm going to show you an organic way to get rid of them. And this is as organic as it can get. I'm going to show you how to get rid of aphids using water. Yes, you heard it right. All you need is a garden hose with a shower or a jet spray and water is all you need to get rid of these aphids and I'll show you how. Just like that, just spray away those aphids and they'll be gone.
You can also hold them while you're washing so you get more control. You can get rid of all your aphids this way. And don't worry about all the water that goes to your zucchini plants. They need all that water. So our zucchini plant has now started forming nice squash. I can see several here, two of them right there. And zucchinis must be harvested when they are tender. They will get very large but they will also get very fibrous. So you need to make sure that you harvest them at the right time. Now this zucchini plant is actually pretty big. So the squash that it produces will also be very big. So I'm going to wait just for a couple more days to harvest the zucchini. Now remember that when the zucchini has started forming squash, it needs a lot of water. Most of the zucchini squash is comprised of water. So you need to make sure you water the plant thoroughly and deeply. Otherwise your fruits are not going to form. So finally it looks like it's time to harvest the zucchini. They look pretty well formed and I do not want to wait till it becomes fibrous so I'm gonna go ahead and harvest these two zucchinis so to harvest the zucchini I'm going to use a set of pruners just make sure you make a clean cut there we go that looks pretty good nice dark colored it's gonna be a little light colored on the other side where it doesn't get a lot of sun and let's go ahead and harvest the other one. Zucchini flowers are also edible by the way. They are actually a delicacy because you can't buy them in the market. And here is our second zucchini. And that looks pretty good. I'm gonna show you two ways to harvest zucchini. The first way is to just hold the zucchini and give it a nice twist just like that and it comes off right away and the other way of course is to use scissors or pruners and make a clean cut and that's another way to harvest your zucchini So I'll see you soon in another episode of California Gardening. Until then, happy gardening.